Hindustani versus, in versus Mayans. Oh, I want to get the, the new unique unit if he goes Eagles. That's good. Good to have you back here a lot. That's good. Hindustanis. Alright. Good to be back, Eigen. Thank you so much for the sub. Sorry if my voice gets a little raspy, by the way. No water vibes. It's hard to talk for a long time. Versus eagles or plumes? Both, I think, is good. Hmm, I might... I'm gonna dress FC straight into unique unit, honestly. I think that's the only way to go fast into an infantry unique unit is to do Drush FC into it. Either that or you go 3TC boom into, into unique unit in mid game. But even that's hard because then our like Imperial Age becomes a factor. Some Eagle Flyer. Unique unit is really cheap, yeah, I agree. Yeah, they do 3 damage a shot, I think. Uh, yeah. Welcome three. back, Hera. Plumes do 3 damage a shot to the Ghulam, but... That's not bad on Castle Age, but in Imperial Age, I think it's kind of bad. It's kind of weak. Yo, Root, thanks for the Prime sub, really appreciate it. Because the Ghulam moves really fast as well. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go with a dress of seat. Can I do a primo dress? I'll do a primo dress of seat. Hmm. <clears throat> here a bit higher up I don't know where his uh, his base is by the way I really think Hindustani is top top three maybe top five Civ uh, in 1v1 I really do think it's quite good Funny, because if I didn't see his sheep, I would actually run headfirst into that. You can take your board, bro. I'm not gonna lame you. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna cheese you. It's all good. It's the fast castle behind us, remember that? I'll just do it like this. It's fine. I, I just need to do small walls. I might even tower my gold eventually. Oh. Uh, Oh, it's the two militia rush, the useless one. She just caught me off guard. Mm. 
No! He got in! What? He really got in like that? Oh... What the hell is wrong with me, man? Your friend Roxy rocks. <laughs> Keep up the good work. Yo, thanks for the twenty-five dollars. Nice. Well, glad. You think that, man? Thank you. Really appreciate the donor and the kind words. Even though it's not directed to me, we take those. Really, I messed up. I messed up that badly. Can I just get a loom so I can fight this useless two minutes of rush? Like literally, so useless. I just don't have. Uh, I don't have loom. Kill the house, man. That's so cringe. These guys have been long distance mining all game, by the way. Oh my god. <laughs> who, 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 like, where's the HP coming from? Where is it coming from? Who's still alive here? Seriously. Nah, screw this guy. I'm not going unique. I'm just gonna kill him, honestly. In game. Fasting? Yeah, I'm actually really tired, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I think that's why I'm playing poorly today. I woke up earlier and I'm fasting. Pretty hard combination, I'm not gonna lie. By the way, I'm really screwed. My wood is on the front somehow. Imagine if I had to play the qualifiers today for Jordan's tournament. Imagine the, the disaster that would be. Good call to not play in it, honestly. It would be really, really tiring. What, I no what I'm noticing, by the way, is that the Dark Age houses have no HP, so the Drush hitting the house is actually pretty good. Going crossbow versus mine seems really bad. I'm gonna go scrims. You're such a cuck, bro. Ah, I took the front wood, look at dummy. Destroyed, honestly. I'm just getting destroyed. Holy moly, I have so so little villagers.
know you come in. It's zero economy for it. The game would be so much easier if I just took the backwoods. So much easier. Get two bags? No, just one. I'll just go unique into Mangan and see what happens. Can't really afford this. Hmm. No, I can't. I can't move out too far. I just have to make sure he's not attacking my wood. That, that's my job right now. If I can get away with this wood front wood line, I'd be a happy camper. I think I'm gonna abandon this woodland completely once I get like close to Castledge. I should be faster castle. Almost guaranteed here. Go to that back woodland now is a good time. Just have to get away from that front one, it's just too too hard to defend. We're way too close in his minds. Get the upgrade now, so that my units are really strong right off, right, right off the bat. I'm not gonna mine any more than three than uh, six fifty stone, by the way, because I want to one TC it here. Oh, oh no! Oh, better help better hope this shit's good, honestly. Pass through damage with these guys, by the way. So I guess archers are really good if the archers are bunched up like that, and I'm attacking them. It's good. It's a good vibe. Too much on gold, eh? Way too much. Need a market to rebalance the eco. Use a couple more wood instead. Why does my unit look like an eagle, by the way? What moves faster, eagle? It looks like it moves faster than an eagle, by the way. That's pretty crazy, eh? for siege now I have to win like I don't think I'm winning I lost way too many bills I'm not winning right now not at all <laughs> same speed as the eagle okay no I'm just gonna delete a house it's just way too far to walk around like that
looking for plume archer transition are we that means i have only a couple a couple minutes to push here before a castle gets dropped i should look to boom after this i think because i'm not gonna win here it's unlikely i win at least i should say Cool arms are insane, eh? What are you doing here? Maybe a, maybe a seed workshop back here can be an angle. Yeah, maybe I maybe I cut here in the production. I sneak it in the back. time microing two archers against me in early game. Not having a great time now though. The Ghulams are punishing him. They have good stats. I like their stats. Gonna prepare a rampage from the back. And that'd be a fun time. What can mines do against this unit though? They don't really have a good option. They really don't have a good option against this unit. I think a ball of crossbow is your best friend. Yeah a ball of crossbow and then just don't lose it basically. Oh, I'm making elephants, true. Wait, am I getting Gajaras? No, I'm not. Gajaras get the bonus. Their own eagles? Maybe. I mean, they can mass eagles quite nicely, but... Let's go for an armored LA on the front. Just, just to hit that. Let's, um... Let's also make sure I have a good farm economy. So I think uh, it's a pretty expensive food composition I'm running right now. Four is lying, I'm winning by a lot right now. It's not the close game. Although he does have a lot of plumes though. Plumes might be somewhat difficult to deal with. I think we, we, we can try here. Let's see what I can do. Ah, uh, plumes are actually good, yeah. Plumes are good against this. But my unit isn't bad against Blooms as well, like... That's not that's not bad, that, that seems like a fair match, honestly. Seems like a fair match. Yeah, yeah, it seems pretty fair.
sent in my armored elephants. Get more ta town centers. Now the OP thing about Hindustani, in my opinion, is that we have all these options and they have a, fan a fantastic eco behind them. Um, before the problem with Indians was that you have a really good economy but your unit's kind of uh, a little bit lackluster. Now we have a ton of good options. I mean, this guy's shading versus a couple of houses, it's not terrible. This guy's a savage, he's gonna hit the villagers like that? Uh, villagers are really, really high value for us. His economy is weak. And plumes are really good, but if you can't get the Imperial Age, mines are really meh. I feel like there's no threat though, like what can he do? He can't run into my base, he just can't, he will get completely collapsed on. It's not a good idea. I, I, have, I feel like he's got no threat on me right now. Counter. Nice little counter attack there. Not bad, not bad. Good reaction from him. Wow, this went from a, an impossible matchup to one of their best, maybe, for Indians now. Should I say the Hindustanis? the castle. These armor elephants are so freaking strong it seems. They do a lot of damage. They hit so fast as well. It's like a fast battering ram. Actually seems good man. Actually this seems pretty good. Maybe I can. Hey, I can. Oh, that's so massive, man. That's so massive. Just trading all my army for his economy. And my economy is so, so big right now. That's the thing with range units, guys. You win. If I. If the goal. If the win condition from him was to kill 50 units before I can kill 50 units, he would definitely win, you know? Like, you can just kite my units. I can never kill him if it's army versus army, but. When I can just dodge him, oh I forgot to get this, then When I can just dodge him and go for the economy, it becomes so impossible for him, what can he do? And now my economy is massive, his economy is really weak. Even though he's got the, the army advantage now, he can't really do anything with it. And he'll die to my Imperial Age, for sure. Yeah, th this save is the only busted one out of uh, all the new ones in my opinion. But this save is actually overpowered. Like, did you see the early game I had this game? I was dead. I was completely dead. Who's calling me? Hello?
I don't even know who it was. I think it was my phone company, but they're looking for my mom. Just call my mom if we're looking for her. Oh, I don't get the last armor upgrade, but it doesn't matter. The elite version is insane. It doesn't matter. Wait, I know what I want to do. For good old time's sake. I don't even need to chase it all. I could just chase it half. Once you get the lead, this unit is cracked. I'll take zero damage from the plumes. Oh, but th this is bad for him, actually. My unit does pass through damage. You know what that means? One shot will actually hit more than one unit. So him bunching up is perfect for me. Look at this. Let me show you guys what's happening here. His units are getting thinned out so fast because the ones in the back are taking damage as well. So they get cleaned up super easily there in the corner. Did you... Is this Luca? I think it felt, it felt like Luca, honestly. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this guy? He's 58 and 3? Oh, I'm a macro player by the way.